Hey guys, this is I, Connor the Hyatt, and today I'm joined with Godly, and today Hello. we're going to be doing a Wild West weapons tutorial, because we ran out of ideas, but also because Alex wanted to do one of these at some point, and I feel like it'd be really helpful to you guys, to maybe new players, or though I would say new players, I don't know many new players will be watching me at this stage I am in. So, we have... Olive over here as our target dummy, and we have Nativ over here as background music. Anyway, if I go into cinematic mode just for the sake of having entrances. Alright, this down here is my personal loadout which I've started using recently. The Mule Shotgun, the Golden Dragoon, and the Lock Pistol. I like these because my general strategy tends to be either run up to someone and just shotgun them, or just a fan revolver. Trouble is, people tend to shoot back. So what I do is, when they shoot back, general strategy is, or probably the best strategy is, to just weave about like this, just like, have a specific, like, just roll about whenever you can. If you can, even implement some rolls, like this. That's control, if you don't already know. Trouble is, you'll have to go out of sprint. It's very hard to pull off properly. But he's also m might not be as fast as just, well, doing whatever this is. It also adds some predictability to yourself. Olive, stand there! Anyway, so, why I use the mule shotgun? Damage wise, it's actually pretty epic. One second, I forgot to turn off friendly fire. Well, here we have body shots. That is. A third health. Might not seem that much, but, well, headshots, one shot. Yes, very surprising for a mule shotgun. Well, I'll just wait for him to heal up a bit. And now that he's healed up, let's test out the headshots. I got Yep. That went pretty far. Ragdoll engine in this game is pretty decent considering it's a shotgun. Anyway, my next gun, the Golden Dragoon, I want to. I usually use alongside with my lock pistol, as if I just move about and as my demonstrator goes out of passive mode. My general strategy is. Olive, uh, grab Olive. a gun for a couple of seconds. Olive. There we go. There, there, there. there my there, general there, strategy there, is it. just run around him. And him. I, all right, if you do kill him there, then that's quite good. But what if he runs away? Such as I will demonstrate with Godly here. Alright, I will sh try and shoot at him, but and, he and he's going to try and run away. What my general strategy is, if I get him low, as I've, if I've run out of bullets here, I'd just take out this. And my other shotgun, with more damage. Troubles with this one, so you just can't, you have to have good aim. And Olive, I mean, Godly stops and he's just spinning. People okay. don't generally do that, but at the same time, skilled players do indeed do that, and it's quite hard to hit them. As per that example. Anyway, now that I've gone through my personal loadout, let's go through some more weapons that I also like to use. Um, let me just reload one second. Now this is a secondary um, setup that I also like to use, considering I have a very cheap loadout, as you can see. I'm not as rich as everyone else and that plays Wild West and, and does YouTube videos on them. Just look how much money I have right now. I spent a lot of money just to set up this video, for God's sake. Anyway, a rifle I like to use, personally, is the Lynx rifle. Now many may claim that, this is, that the Winchester rifle is a lot better, but personally I think it's, um, well... Based on my experience, it's a lot more efficient, as it when Olive, if I can shoot him anyway, Olive. Go to pass him, mode, Olive. Please. There we go. If I can shoot him in the foot, that's also the same damage, body damage as the shotgun. However, I, you have to have more accuracy, as with the mule shotgun, but uh, it also has more ammunition. But thing is with the Lynx bolt action rifle is that it does majority damage on headshots but not full damage 
So this thing's basically a mule shotgun, but you need better aim. But it also has more ammunition. <laughs> as such, mm, with this example. Yeah. And another one, which is also pretty, very controversial, considering this is a pay-to-win gun, is the Mauser. Personally, I really like this weapon. I don't use it that much, but I love its design, I love its, like, ammunition amount. And I love shooting olive wheels. I mean, look at this. Does this not look entertaining? Right. Yeah. Wait one second, I think he's fully dead. Oh, he's alive, never mind. Now that I have, um, well, got Olive back here, I'd now talk about the Sharps rifle. My personal, personally, I think this is the, the best sniper rifle can, compared to the Hartford rifle, considering that, well, look at this sight. This is an actual sight compared to the iron sight knockoff that is the Hartford rifle. And Olive, stop moving. I'll compare the damage with the foot shot to him. And look at this. That's the same amount of damage as a Lynx bolt action headshot. Now, um. Oh god, I'm gonna wait for him to heal up again. Now, let's compare the headshot compared to the body shot. You can probably guess what's gonna happen here, but like. That's a lot of damage. Yes. Anyway, personally, all these weapons are good weapons, in my opinion. But here's one that I've not really been using much, but I've actually come to really like recently. The Yellow Boy Rifle. It's the cheapest rifle in the game, but, yeah, Flexcape indeed cannot fix that. But, the Yellow Boy, as I, you know, I keep calling it Yellow Belly for some reason, I don't know why. They probably did a name change without me realising. But, this is like an early access preview of what the Winchester Rifle is. Which, in my opinion, is a pretty decent gun. Also, look at this firing speed one second. For a lever action rifle, that's pretty decent compared to the Lynx. Yeah. Alright. Now, I'll show him by body damage to headshot damage. Not much. But, headshot damage should be a little different. Half health. Um. <laughs> yeah, this thing's actually, like, it's decent damage, it's just, like, you got to have decent accuracy to actually perform well with it. I mean, look at that, I expected to one-shot him there. I mean, even the Mauser can kill him from now. Just look at that. I really like using the Mauser. You can probably tell. Um... Okay, we're getting... Well, we're being looked at. Godly. Anyway, now that we've gone through my special weapons, let's go through Godly's. Godly, what kind of weapons do you like to use? And please demonstrate them on not Olive. So usually, I use the harmonica rifle as my primary. This is because Olive could get a horse. Hostile this is because... Out. This is because as a uh, your as a horse moves, it is very increasingly hard to hit. Luckily, the the harmonica rifle. Oh, look, could you please move around a bit? The harmonica rifle is pretty good at taking damage slowly and quite accurately at yeah. horses. As long as you don't get a horse rammed, it's perfectly fine for taking out horses. Yeah, it, I mean, you, could, say it's also... you could do a similar thing with the peacekeeper because, like, when you fire yeah. that, all six bullets hitting the horse, it just insta kills it. Oh yeah. <laughs> And they can just pull out a shotgun and just like as the use, as the horse riders on the floor just finish them off. Oh yeah, that's another good thing. Mm. Uh, <laughs> the reverse but, can be said for actual pe ho well, like horse running people. Yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> another good thing about the harmonica rifle, uh, I'd say it's actually a bit better than the Lynx in my opinion. This is because the Lynx does twenty five damage per shot, but uh, for the time to reload to you know to get to the next shot, the harmonica rifle has already put two shots down. Yeah, that's because, well, it's an automatic yeah. rifle. Yes, and also because it's got a large ammo capacity, yeah. I quite like it. Hmm. It's also My, the only uh, automatic rifle in the game, fun fact. Oh yeah, and uh, I think the Mauser's automatic, I've never tried it. It, it is kind of automatic, really. It's like, it's I also like to use the... To it. Oh, yeah. Also, um, Olive, please get off your horse. Yeah, uh, yeah, you can come up, man. Yeah. Anyway, 
One final weapon I'd like to talk about, personally, is the bow. I do not like using this thing, simply because of how inaccurate it can be. Like, I know I just did, like, majority health to him, with a body shot, but, well, look at that. Wait. That's a lot of damage. Very inaccurate. Good observation, Olive. I'll give you another one for that. <laughs> Whoops. Uh -huh. Anyway, um, body shots. These can come one shot, and Olive, you're not supposed to shoot me, that's not nice. Yeah, these things aren't very accurate when they start shaking. We need a new test dummy, don't we? Um, yeah. Native. Native. Where are you? Native. <laughs> Native. Native. Um, uh, I think he's, um... You look I think drunk. he's passed out. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I was going to say that, but I thought you'd you like to monetize you, but not that <laughs> not like you have to monetize. I don't even have yeah, not... subscribers for that yet. <laughs> He is in pain. But what if he was in Spain? Now get up. <laughs> I'm joking. Anyway, um, let's get back to Godly. Godly. Um, wait, where's Olive? Olive. Yeah, Olive. Olive. Olive, get off the piano. Olive. <laughs> right, we're moving to a nicer environment now. So. What were you saying about the Navy pistol, Godly? Yes, I would recommend the Navy revolver. The Navy revolver, uh, it was its price was reduced from four thousand two hundred to three thousand something, hmm. um, but it's actually pretty good. The Navy revolver does very very high damage for yeah. a pistol. Triple is, and it also, doesn't fan fire though. Yeah, that's one big problem. Well, but uh, it makes up for that by having quite high accuracy, high fire rate, and very fast reload. And I would kind of re recommend it if you are kind of the person like me or Connor who just runs around and shoots people. Yeah. Yeah, Godly, just test it's out also the quite damage easy. on body shots for for us, please. Okay. Alright. Body shot body and shot. headshot. Yeah. Whoa. With two um, shots, that's, that's quite good out of it out of its barrel of six. So like personally I have a good experience and like I have a good like experience with the uh, Navy revolver, but are you going to shoot one of my testers, mate? I'll have you. Whoops. Whoa, that's that's How a indeed. lot of damage. Well, at least you can put in a new eyeball now. Anyway, mm -hmm. um, any other weapons you want to talk about? Mm, oh, yeah. Also, one more. Uh, the Model 3. The Model 3 the is Model 3. very, very... In my opinion, yeah. well, our opinion, the best pistol in the game. Yeah, it's very, very good. Go mm. Kill him! <laughs> See, Olive just killed it with the Model 3, thank you. But yes. the Model 3... Yeah, but good demonstration of damage for there. <laughs> yeah, and good also fan speed. You've contributed to this video without being shot at. Mm -hmm. I would say that the Model 3 is an extremely, extremely good pistol, mainly because the Model 3 is a, it's just stupid cheap. This thing is... <laughs> I pay you in bullets, but that's about it. <laughs> mm -hmm. yeah. Free lead. Yeah. If you pull free, that out of you, then... Lead. Yeah. Anyway, guys, that's going to be it for today. Hope you all enjoyed the video and so this was very informative. And oh, wait, uh, could I talk about the Model 3? Oh, yeah, the Model 3, yeah. Keep walking. Oh, yeah, keep one last thing. Yeah, Model 3. Uh, it's thing. an extremely cheap pistol, only £350, so I'd say it's very good for starters. Yeah, um, very the good. reload, it does lower damage to most revolvers, but the reload. Yeah. Very, very fast. Yeah. Also, it's the fan. Like the peacekeeper, but does slightly more damage. Yeah, also, the fan speed is very. Very Pass. accurate. And the fan Look at all yeah, that. Very. very close together. If, if uh, wait, let me shoot a ball. Yeah, the only problem is that it doesn't actually make a bullet mark uh, if you shoot it. But other guns do. Yeah. Uh, not this one, I guess. And also, the fan accuracy is very, very high compared to yeah. other revolvers. So, yes. yeah, that's good. Yeah. Well, anyway, guys, I hope you all enjoyed this video and. Uh... Hello, what have we here? That's me! Godly, Godly, why do you have a gun? Godly, why do you have um, a gun out? Ah.